Welcome to the channel. My name is Josie, this home tour is at Moni's house, I hope you enjoy it and find lots of inspiration to decorate. How to decorate the living room with sofa covers and fabrics. Start by choosing a fabric or sofa cover that complements the overall style and color scheme of your living room. Consider your existing furniture, wall color, and decor to make sure they all coordinate. Consider layering different fabrics or covers for added texture and depth. You can place a throw blanket over the back or armrests of the sofa or add decorative cushions in coordinating colors or patterns. Don't forget to coordinate other elements in your living room with the new sofa cover or fabric. You can incorporate matching curtains, rugs, or artwork to tie the entire room together. Remember to have fun and experiment with different fabrics, colors, and patterns to create a living room that reflects your personal style and makes you feel comfortable and at home. To make a shabby chic dining room look cozy, you can follow these steps. Choose mismatched chairs. Opt for chairs in different styles and finishes, such as vintage wooden chairs, upholstered armchairs, or even a bench. Look for chairs with distressed or worn out finishes to enhance the shabby chic aesthetic. Mix and match tableware. Instead of using a matching set of tableware, mix and match different patterns, textures, and colors. Remember, the key to achieving a cozy shabby chic dining room is to combine different styles, textures, and colors while maintaining an inviting and relaxed vibe. Decorating a shabby chic kitchen with cabinets and shelves can give it a charming, vintage-inspired look. Here are a few tips to help you achieve this aesthetic. Choose distressed or weathered cabinets, Look for cabinets with a worn-out look or opt for distressing techniques to give them character. Add glass doors. Replace some of the cabinet doors with glass ones to display your vintage dishware or colorful glassware. Use a mix of clear and patterned glass for an eclectic look. Use open shelves. Install open shelves on your kitchen walls, where you can display vintage plates, mason jars, or antique kitchenware. Arrange them in a loosely organized manner for a relaxed look. Display vintage kitchen accessories. Look for vintage or retro kitchen accessories like old scales, wooden spoons, antique teapots, or copper pots. These items can be displayed on open shelves or countertops as stylish decor. Incorporate vintage style handles and knobs. Add antique or vintage style handles and knobs to revamp your cabinets. Opt for glass, ceramic, or brass finishes to enhance the vintage feel. Use decorative storage baskets. Incorporate wicker or wire baskets on open shelves or countertops to store produce, kitchen linens, or vintage cookbooks. These baskets will add texture and warmth to the space. Include floral patterns. Use floral patterns for window treatments, chair cushions, or tablecloths to bring additional shabby chic charm. Opt for soft colors and delicate designs. Remember, the key to achieving a shabby chic kitchen with cabinets and shelves is to embrace imperfections and create a cozy, lived-in atmosphere.
a modern shabby chic style in white and pink, you will need to focus on blending both contemporary and vintage elements while incorporating soft colors and feminine touches. Below are some decorating ideas for each room. In the living room, choose a white or light pink color for the walls as a base. Incorporate a white or pink sofa with vintage-inspired details, such as ruffled edges or tufted upholstery. Select vintage-style furniture pieces like a distressed white coffee table or a side table with a pink floral pattern. Combine modern artwork in white frames with vintage frames displaying floral prints or feminine artwork. Decorate the room with fluffy white or pink throw pillows and a cozy pink rug. Add shabby chic accents such as distressed white vases with pink flowers, vintage candle holders, and feminine decorative accessories. In the dining room, paint the walls white or light pink, or use pink and white floral wallpaper as an accent wall. Choose a white, distressed dining table with antique-style chairs, upholstering them in a light pink fabric. Hang a chandelier with crystal accents and white or pink lampshades to create a feminine focal point. Decorate the table with delicate white or pink table linens, vintage china, and floral pattern tableware. Hang mirrored or vintage frames with pink accents on the walls and add small pink or white decorative items like candle holders or vases. In the kitchen. Keep the kitchen walls white and choose white cabinets with distressed details. Add a white or light pink backsplash in a subway tile pattern or floral design. Display vintage white or pink appliances or small appliances like a white kettle or toaster. Hang vintage style open shelves with white or pink dishes, teacups, and glassware. Use pink or white curtains or blinds to soften the window area. Add shabby chic accessories like vintage cake stands, floral wallpaper borders, and pink or white canisters.
In the bedroom, choose a bronze bed frame with ornate details and add a bedding set with ruffles or floral patterns. Remember, in shabby chic style, it's essential to maintain a balance between contemporary and vintage pieces. This home tour highlights an open space and here are some steps to help you decorate an open living room, kitchen, and dining room. Choose a color scheme. Select a color scheme that complements the existing furniture and decor in your space. Select wallpaper. Choose a wallpaper design that suits your personal style and adds visual interest to the space. Consider the size of the pattern and how it will look on a large wall. Ensure that the wallpaper complements the chosen color scheme. Focus on the accent wall. Use the wallpaper on one wall to create a focal point in the room. This wall can be in the living room and dining room area, depending on the layout of your space. Coordinate tablecloth and sofa covers. Pick a tablecloth that complements the wallpaper and matches the color scheme. It should enhance the overall aesthetic of the room. Balance the room, ensure that the color scheme, patterns, and textures of the tablecloth, sofa covers, and wallpaper work together harmoniously. Consider the overall balance and visual flow when arranging the furniture and decor in the space. Add accessories, enhance the overall look of the room with accessories such as decorative pillows, curtains, and artwork. Highlight the dining area. Make the dining area stand out by adding a centerpiece on the table, such as a vase with fresh flowers. This will draw attention to the designated dining space within the open floor plan. Consider using neutral shades or coordinating colors for a cohesive look.
Remember, the key is to create a cohesive and visually appealing space by harmonizing the colors, patterns, and textures. Experiment with different arrangements and adjustments until you achieve the desired result. To decorate a shabby chic cottage style in white, follow these simple steps. In the living room, start with a clean white canvas, paint the walls and ceiling white to create a fresh and bright backdrop for the shabby chic decor. Add texture with soft fabrics, use light and airy fabrics, such as linen or lace, to create a cozy and comfortable atmosphere. You can incorporate these fabrics through curtains, tablecloths, or throw blankets. Display vintage accessories. Decorate your space with vintage accessories such as white distressed picture frames, antique mirrors, vintage chandeliers, or white ceramic vases filled with fresh flowers. In the dining room, choose vintage-inspired furniture, look for white distressed or painted furniture pieces with intricate details, such as a distressed white farmhouse table, a vintage white chest of drawers or a white cane chair.
kitchen. Mix and match furniture styles. Don't be afraid to combine different styles of furniture, such as mixing a rustic white farmhouse kitchen island. Use whitewashed or distressed finishes. Opt for whitewashed or distressed finishes on wooden furniture or decor pieces to enhance the shabby chic aesthetic. In the bedroom, incorporate floral patterns. Use white floral patterns in your upholstery, curtains, bedding, or throw pillows to add a feminine touch to the space. Look for vintage-inspired floral prints or delicate lace patterns. Decorate with vintage-inspired artwork. Hang vintage-inspired artwork on the walls to complete the shabby chic look. Look for white-framed vintage prints or delicate white canvas paintings. Remember, the key to achieving the shabby chic cottage style in white is to embrace imperfections and create a cozy, inviting space with worn and weathered elements.
To create a modern shabby chic style in white and pink, you will need to focus on blending both contemporary and vintage elements while incorporating soft colors and feminine touches. Below are some decorating ideas for each room. In the living room, choose a white or light pink color for the walls as a base. Incorporate a white or pink sofa with vintage-inspired details, such as ruffled edges or tufted upholstery. Select vintage-style furniture pieces like a distressed white coffee table or a side table with a pink floral pattern. Combine modern artwork in white frames with vintage frames displaying floral prints or feminine artwork. Decorate the room with fluffy white or pink throw pillows and a cozy pink rug. Add shabby chic accents such as distressed white vases with pink flowers, vintage candle holders, and feminine decorative accessories. In the dining room, paint the walls white or light pink, or use pink and white floral wallpaper as an accent wall. Choose a white, distressed dining table with antique-style chairs, upholstering them in a light pink fabric. Hang a chandelier with crystal accents and white or pink lampshades to create a feminine focal point. Decorate the table with delicate white or pink table linens, vintage china, and floral pattern tableware. Hang mirrored or vintage frames with pink accents on the walls and add small pink or white decorative items like candle holders or vases. In the kitchen. Keep the kitchen walls white and choose white cabinets with distressed details. Add a white or light pink backsplash in a subway tile pattern or floral design. Display vintage white or pink appliances or small appliances like a white kettle or toaster. Hang vintage style open shelves with white or pink dishes, teacups, and glassware. Use pink or white curtains or blinds to soften the window area. Add shabby chic accessories like vintage cake stands, floral wallpaper borders, and pink or white canisters.
In the bedroom, choose a bronze bed frame with ornate details and add a bedding set with ruffles or floral patterns. Welcome to the channel, I hope you find ideas to inspire you in this home tour of Carrie's house. My name is Jossie and below I will leave you some secrets to decorate in the shabby chic style. Color palette, choose a soft and light color scheme for all the rooms, focusing on pastel hues such as blush pink, mint green, baby blue, or lavender. These colors will create a calm and soothing atmosphere. In the living room. Furniture and textures. Add comfortable seating like overstuffed chairs, slip covered sofas, or upholstered chairs with floral prints. Integrate soft and flowing fabrics into the rooms. Use lace, linen, and cotton materials for curtains and tablecloths. Add throw pillows in floral or ruffle designs to enhance the shabby chic style. Accessories. Decorate with vintage or antique accessories to add character. Place vintage picture frames, antique vases, or old-style teapots on shelves or tables. Look for ornate mirrors with distressed finishes to hang on walls. Rugs and carpets. Lay down vintage-style area rugs in pastel hues to add warmth and texture. Look for distressed or faded designs that complement the overall shabby chic theme. In the dining room, walls, paint the walls in pale pastel shades. You can also use wallpaper with faded floral patterns or shabby chic motifs. Consider adding a shiplap accent wall or installing wainscoting for an extra touch of texture. Dining room chairs with lining covers creating texture is essential in this style. It adds elegance at a low cost. Even if you use light colors, it is easy to wash. In the shabby chic kitchen, display your ceramic collection by creating a focal point in the kitchen, 
such as on a kitchen counter or open shelving. Arrange the pieces in an aesthetically pleasing manner and ensure they are visible to make a statement. Use ceramic pieces as functional items in the kitchen. For example, you can display a collection of vintage teacups and saucers on a cake stand and use them for tea parties or afternoon tea. This adds both decoration and a practical use for your ceramics. Mix and match your ceramic collection with other shabby chic elements. For instance, use ceramic planters for herbs or flowers, or place decorative ceramic pitchers or vases full of fresh or dried flowers on the kitchen table or windowsill. Don't be afraid to experiment and play with different arrangements and combinations. The shabby chic style allows for a mix of different patterns, textures, and colors, so have fun curating your ceramic collection to create a unique and charming kitchen space. In the bedroom. The key to achieving a shabby chic style in pastel colors is to combine vintage, distressed, and soft elements to create a cozy and romantic atmosphere in the bedroom. Romantic bedspreads and duvets with flower prints fit well in any bedroom with a bronze bed, and it is easy to achieve a cozy and comfortable atmosphere just by using cushions and large pillows. Decorative accents, place vintage books, pastel-colored glassware, and delicate porcelain figurines on shelves or side tables. Hang whimsical artwork, botanical prints, or floral paintings on the walls. Add a distressed wooden clock or vintage-inspired signs for a nostalgic touch. Hello! Welcome to the channel, my name is Jossie and today we will do a home tour of Tammy's house, here you will find ideas to inspire you with a charming shabby chic style. In the living room. To begin with, we can highlight the shabby chic style sofa covers that combine with the colors and style of the living room, in addition the cushions have prints and pastel colors with vintage characteristics that stand out against the white and at the same time gives it the balance in decoration. A tip from this cozy room to enhance the shabby chic vibe is to use seat covers made of natural, distressed materials such as cotton, linen or burlap and if you can, 
look for seat covers with ruffles, lace trim or frayed edges for an authentic look. Another feature you can note is to consider adding vintage-inspired wall art, floral curtains, antique furniture or distressed wood accents to complete the overall shabby chic aesthetic. Lastly, maintain a sense of balance without going overboard with the shabby chic theme. Remember, shabby chic is all about creating a comfortable and charming atmosphere, so have fun experimenting with different seat covers and textures to achieve the desired look for your living room. In the dining room. In this cozy dining room, it was possible to mix and match different vintage styles and eras without fear. The furniture is all white but stands out and displays antique porcelain and antique plates on open shelves in addition to having a sideboard to add a touch of elegance and nostalgia to the space. Shabby chic is about accepting imperfections and creating a cozy, lived-in atmosphere. Let your creativity guide you when creating a unique and personalized vintage dining room. In the kitchen. Here the style was changed by simply choosing the right moldings, opting for decorative moldings with intricate designs that are characteristic of the shabby chic style such as curved moldings, scallops and floral motifs. Additionally, the moldings were given an aged and worn look very gently to the edges and corners of the moldings. Additionally, elements were added to enhance the shabby chic style such as vintage-inspired knobs or handles, open shelves with distressed edges. And finally, the decorations could not be missing with vintage charm. shabby chic romantic bedroom. I love bedding to highlight the shabby chic style. Here bedding is selected with delicate vintage inspired designs, such as floral and lace motifs. Opting for soft and light materials such as cotton, linen and chiffon. Adding layers with romantic blankets and lace and ruffled pillowcases. Soft and fluid fabrics were also incorporated throughout the room. Using sheer and lace curtains to allow natural light to filter in and create a dreamy atmosphere. In any decoration it is important to have the personal touch, that is why we encourage you to infuse your personality into the room by showing sentimental elements or incorporating things that have a special meaning for you. This will make the space feel truly romantic and tailored to your taste like in this example. Remember to keep the overall aesthetic soft, romantic and slightly distressed to achieve the desired shabby chic look. <laughs>